guys, I have waited all day long to open these and take a look at them. I um, ordered these back in, what, when they came out, so like, what was it, end of October, and they finally arrived today. So I'll be opening a Little Fee Huayu and a Mini Fee Luja, and both of them are the designer package. So I'm going to start off with the actual dolls first. Um, I'll open up Little Fee Huayu first. little fee box same as always and this is my first time getting a beauty wipe there we go certificate is here in the manual Ooh. wow 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 I really like this beauty wipe Here's the sleeping face, unpainted. Oh, I should have grabbed one of my other, like my Emmy white, because they're more of like a yellow creamy color. I will save this for later. This is the vampire event head. focusing here. I haven't used this webcam in about five million years, so well, well, well. this is not my first little fee. I had a Bisso a long while ago as well. She's got some marks on her from the packaging though, but they'll come off with the magic eraser. Let's take this off. Yes, the smell of resin. You can see the magnets through here very slightly. These spots are not stains. There's actual magnets in the head. And here she is. Wow, I love these eyes. My friend actually has the mini Fi Huayu, so it will be cool to like compare them when we get a chance. Oh, I bet this is all blurry. I'm sorry, guys. I intended to stream from my phone, but I wasn't able to get it working. So she came with a sleeping head. Let's see. So this is the event head oh wow okay i love it look at this packaging huh? oh i'm like leaning over my bed so my my legs hurt <laughs> There we go. Try not to touch it too much because oils. Come on, focus. I will be posting pictures to my Instagram, so if this is blurry, then you should um, follow me on Instagram so you can see this a little better. My username, which I'll put in the description later, is diecast.doll. So you can look me up. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> I love the little tongue. Let's see if I can force it to focus. This is a Logitech webcam and I really don't like that it's not focusing at all. 
Boo. There we go. Awesome. Awesome. Holy ass, she is so pretty. Let me see if I can show you guys these eyes. Come on, little camera, you can do this. Or not. It cannot do this. <laughs> okay. Oh well. We tried. So let's check out the full set. The outfit. And yeah, so as I said, so she comes with the sleepy face. Didn't really show that too much, I guess. The event head. One I just showed you. Without white lashes, by the way. I know that was really trendy for a while. I don't know. I mean, still is. And these extra hands. I forgot what number they are. And then, here's her outfit. I love that it comes in, like, a branded box. So she is a little fox. you guys can hear me. I did enable the mic. Someone type in the chat if you can't hear me. Okay, so here we go. We have her tail. Full fur with a pin on the back. We have a wig, a long and wavy charcoal gray wig, and then the outfit accessories. This looks like it's the head accessory. The shoes. Wow, these are really cool. Here's the ears. And her outfit. I normally don't like the, the full set outfits, but I'm really digging this one. So her dress. And the underskirt. So it goes like this. Oops. It's going to go like this. So the ears, you put them on after you put the wig on, but I just wanted to give you a close-up of them. So these are attached via the magnets on the head, like this. But I'll be putting that on top of the wig. And I'll be doing that later. These shoes are really cool. I will do all this later. First, I want to take a look at Luca.
do about all this bubble wrap because I can reuse it for my shipments. <laughs> Here's the box. Seal is in here. Manual. Just for cushion, uh, she comes with healed feet. If you don't know, Fairyland dolls work on a magnet basis, so you can easily snap off their hands and feet and change them out. These are the extra hands. And then here she is. Oh, let me take off her face protector. Yeah, her legs look good to me. There have been some complaints about bowing that some people have experienced with the legs, but hers are fine. Wow, okay, I love this shimmer that they're putting everywhere. Oh, can't see this, can you? Let me move my light over. These eyes are gorgeous. Holy hell. She is absolutely beautiful. And I don't think the camera's capturing it, but she has a very fine shimmer all over her face. It makes her look almost like wet. Very iridescent, very a uh, vampire. <laughs> very, very twilight vampire. Which I don't mind because it is beautiful. One of her eyes is loose, but I won't fix that. It's really easy, you just go like this. <laughs> well, I'm actually having a struggle here. Bit of a chip on the MSC up here too. Okay, I will get that later. I don't know. It's a little tighter because my clothes head cap is not so tight. It's actually quite loose. But yeah, I will fix that later. So I'm like, why you? She has human ears. Because she's not a vampire. <laughs> This to the side. And let's take a look at her outfit. So same. She gets a branded branded box. And this is the again, this is the designer set. There's two full sets and the designer set has like everything. And the full set only has some things in it. So here are the ears. Ooh. Okay. It's like they're like translucent. Have a design in them and the edges have gold paint. Here's the back. 
very cool. And yes, they also attach by magnet, which she has pre-installed in her head cap. I'm glad nothing is broken as well in shipment. So I don't want to deal with the hassle of getting replacements. Ah. Here, spare event head. I was just thinking, like, wait a minute, where's the event head? head so the difference is that she has a little toothy bite compared to the original head and yeah it's a full head because many fee heads are different um, with mini V is, um, the face attaches to the neck, but with little V, the head back attaches to the neck, so they can't just send the front because then you don't have a head back. <laughs> I think I'm going to put this on her. I have to wrap this back up when I put it away. are heels so you would have to switch out her feet so she can I mean she could technically wear these too but it won't look right little sandals oh they're really nicely made also silver but it's actually no it's like a white yeah it's it's white and it's really long <laughs> it's like her entire length almost then we have accessories bloomers these are really nice and her dress Sleeves. Oh. Yeah, this is like um bustier kind of thing. And it looks goofy right now, but this goes around her torso. And this is and the underskirt. So it goes like this. Um, 
or rather this is the underskirt or overskirt. I have to look at a picture. I always forget. This has like a gold sheen to it. And little lace strips. Yeah, that's the full set, so I'm gonna go ahead and dress one. I'll do her first and then we'll do for you. video is of decent quality. I didn't have a chance to test it at all. I was trying to use this like mobile app thing and it I would click go live and nothing was happening so and then I tried to go live from the app directly like in the YouTube app and it said like my account isn't like enabled for that. I think these are hand warmers, not socks. And this is her choker. Wow, look at that tiny. <laughs> you see how little that is? It's like. Oh, I'll try to. Oh, it does focus. It's just really bad at focusing automatically. Come on. Nope. Try trick it. No. Okay. <laughs> well, hopefully you're watching this on a larger device. Sugar. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these are arm sleeves. See, come off really easily. smell like <laughs> like resin all night to have like pegs before. I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of the Pookie Fee. Pookie Fay. Okay, I have to consult the photo because I forgot. Okay. So first the gray. These are all a pretty nice material too. It's like a it's not stretchy. And it is held by little clips like this. And here's how the sewing is. It's really good. No loose threads at all. Yep, no loose threads. I should have put this on first. No, this goes over because it's open in them. I'm confused. Does it go under or over? 
Let me see. I'm going to look it up. She doesn't even wear it in some of these pictures. It looks like she's wearing it underneath. Okay. So I should have, should have put that on first, but that's okay. I wish this had a clip so it'd be easier to put on. I'll take these off because it's going to be too hard. Ooh, there's an extra black ribbon from something. Uh, I must have gotten in tight from one of these. They're just tied around. No, this one was swooped down. So where's this extra one from? Maybe it's just a replacement. There's one by the brooch, and then one down here, so where's the third one from? I am very, very confused. I'll figure it out later. How the heck are you supposed to attach this? There's no clips in the back. What is holding it?
look at Fairyland's site and see what it says in the pictures. Because there's nothing to hold this on. Absolutely nothing. Be nice if it loaded. <sighs> Come on, nothing is loading. Gonna check on the Denver doll site. Denver doll. Fairyland. Line when I free. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. That shouldn't be so hard. Oh my goodness, what is this? Okay, mini fee. It's not under full package. There's nothing there. Okay, so active line. Then girl line. Luha, okay. There's only two pictures and it's of her face. This is ridiculous. Why are there no photos on, on the Fairyland site? It's weird. They're broken links. Why? I'm very concerned. <laughs> okay, the corset is tightened on. What is it tightened on with? With what? Oh, okay, I figured it out. The ribbon is for the corset lacing in the back. <laughs> oh my god, it's such a pain. Fairyland, why? So I have to put it on her and then lace it up. Why are you like this? This is so unnecessary. One of these little things breaks your, your shit out of luck. 
Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. I'm gonna have to find like a needle or something to make this easier with. This is ridiculous. There was no need to do that. They could have just put little clips in here and called it a day. There's no reason for there to be a ribbon here. Like, no one's going to see the back. There, you can't even see the back in photos. In the stock photos. So, this is annoying as hell. I'm not happy. This is frustrating because this is very small. It's hard to work with. I don't, I don't know if I have a needle with an eye this big. It's also really hot because the light is on me and I'm super annoyed. Okay, I'm not doing this. Not today. Okay, let's get her wig and her shoes on at least. The wig is not white, it's, I guess the top layer is white, but inside it's pink. Just a small layer of it. I heard bad feedback about the Fairyland wigs. Like that they're bad quality and stuff, so... Oh my god, what the fuck? This is so tight. Is this even gonna fit? Like, this head cap barely stretches. <laughs> Am I supposed to get this on? Oh my goodness. I'm having the hardest of times with this. Yeah, this this wig is not going on. It, it has no stretch. supposed to put this on. I need to take my sweater off. It's way too hot in here. Okay, let's try this again. I've put like a million wigs on and this is harder than it needs to be. Okay. I I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. It it doesn't stretch. Look. There's a little stretch inside it, but the the edges need to stretch. Look. I'm I'm pulling it. Nothing's happening. That needs to stretch so you can pull it over the back. It's a 6-7 size, so it should work.
Okay, finally. That was way harder than it needed to be. So the magnets are kind of in a weird position there on the side of her head by her temple. <laughs> like here's her human ear and here's they're like where the horns would be. Hmm. Well maybe they meant these to be horns, I guess. Then it won't make sense. I don't know, I thought they were ears. They look like bunny ears. I mean, they're the same ears they use for their bunny whatever sets. But I guess they're horns. Turn her. I wish I had a better camera set up. I really don't like this. I don't set it up like this when I film my videos, but I can't really stream this to Twitch. That would be weird. That's my gaming channel, so... You can't see me, but I'm struggling with the lacing of the shoe here. It's very skinny ribbon. Very skinny and slippery ribbon. I don't know what I'm doing because it's so small. All right.
Oh, there she is, full set. Or, I guess, almost full set, because I couldn't get her corset on. I love these bloomers, though, they're really cute. Pretty. Okay, so she's done mostly, and next I'm going to dress Little Fee. Why are you? Because she is naked right now. I didn't give her any bloomers, I guess because you can't see them, but you can see them with Luha. Okay, we'll start from the bottoms, which, by the way, have a built-in petticoat. This has barely any stretch to it as well, and there's no, some loose bits here. Yeah, there's loose threads on this one, but it's supposed to be like that. I don't know why this doesn't have a clip or anything, though it's going to be hell getting this on her, over her hips. Okay, I was being dramatic and went over really easily. And yes, I am trying to be very quiet because my parentals are sleeping. Okay. There's that. I think this goes on her head. around her neck. Put this one first. Oh, that separates. Little crochet belt clips in the back, but it's not attached to a dress. You can take the whole thing off. You could use it as a headdress or something if you wanted to. off really easily. It's a faceplate system. I don't want to change the eyes right now. Ooh, these don't have pegs in the back. <laughs> That's weird. I haven't seen that before. Well, I also haven't bought, this. I bought these eyes before either.
this dress is not tight fitting whatsoever. So if you want to use it on a um, different doll, it should probably be fine. Because um, as some of you know, little feet are a little bit um, slimmer than a lot of USD. More standard size USD. interface. Let's do the shoes next. They are of a suede material. Design on the heel is uh, what's the word? Not embossed. The other word, where it's sticking out. It's not painted on. It's like physical. You can kind of see it in the reflection there. You can technically take the feet off and then put the shoe on if you want to. And then you pop the whole foot on with the shoe on it. <laughs> you can definitely do that. a lot easier. magnet from her ankle joint came out. I don't know if they're all loose or if it just wasn't glued in well. Uh, I'm gonna need something to get this out because it's a really strong magnet. Yeah, I have to get it out.
no. Let's try the other foot. Yeah, the other one's in there. So it's just a loose magnet, which not really a big deal. And I can slip the foot right in there. Don't even have to take the buckle off. And there we go. It's quick and easy. Um, let me figure out where this thing goes. I just searched Little Fee Why You and the first result is is my stream. <laughs> so this goes around her neck. Let's see if there's a better photo I can find. Mm. Maybe I should spell out Little Fee. Little Fee. Okay, I realize it's probably Little Fae, but I like to say Little Fee because it sounds cuter to me. Mm, yeah, why are, what, what is up with Fairyland's website? The pictures are not loading. Like the detail pictures. Broken length. That's really, really weird. The main photo, you can click on it, but that's it. Okay, so it seems like this just goes around her neck. And the chain is a necklace. Oh, it's a little rosary. Even though she's a vampire fox girl, mostly fox girl, she has a rosary. Right. <laughs> so this goes around her, but how do they figure that? Because it'll that don't make no sense. Let me check those pictures again. Hold it like this.
Okay. Okay, that's pretty cute. Rosary is kind of weird, but we'll, um, we'll use it. So her wig is nice and wavy, and then it's uniformly gray. Not much stretch either, but probably be easier to put on. And then, yeah, it just slides on super easily. It's actually the same size as, like, mini fee hats are the same size as little fee hats. So you can, well, not all of them. Don't quote me on that. Not all of them. Like Chloe said, wears a 6 7 wig, which is what little feet wear. A 6 7 inch wig. Fixing her hair a little bit. I mean, these fibers could be softer, but it's not the worst whatsoever. I've touched way worse wipes before. Yeah, I'm sorry about the camera. I don't have another one to stream things like this with. Apparently it makes noise every time it focuses. I don't hear anything, but... Ugh, that sucks. I'm pretty sure I paid like $60 for this camera, so it shouldn't be doing that. Not the most expensive, but still. Where is the magnet? There it is. Yes, I am touching them with my bare hands. I washed my hands before handling them, so don't freak out. Why would anyone freak out? Because the oils on your hands can damage um, face ups. And here she is. I'm not gonna put the tail on because. No need to put it on right now, but I'll do it later. So, there we go. The Little Fee Huayu and Mini Fee Luca. Both um, designer sets. I love the shoes. And one more time. Here is. Man, this camera really sucks. Here is um, Little Fee Huayu's event head with default face up or even face plate and here is Luha's event head with face up oh, 
something on the camera. Well, that's it. That's the end of the box opening, and I'll be taking nicer pictures tomorrow and putting them up on my Instagram. So I'll put a link in the description after this, but yeah, Instagram.com, whatever, diecast all. So yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. Sorry for the shitty camera. I'll try better next time. I have to get something else.